Hey, so setting up Black Friday and Cyber Monday deals, make sure you do it in plenty in advance, at least a week ahead of time. So in Seller Central, go to Advertising Prime Exclusive Discounts. Click Create Discount. And give it a name. And you can either check Black Friday discount, Cyber Monday discount, or both. And it will automatically put the date in there. If you check both, and this is new this year, it will run all through the weekend from Cyber from Black Friday all the way to Cyber Monday. So I'm doing that for my products. So I say why not? Or if you want the discount to be a little bit different for both days, then do a separate one for each. I'm just going to do both. Click Save and Add Products. And then two options to add the uh, details, either right here or via upload file. You would click there to download the uh, sheet file. I uploaded it to Google Docs so I can do it in here. And then it's very simple. Put the SKU, percentage off, or dollar amount off, or fixed price, or, um, and then, so put the what the discount will be, the percentage, lowest price, and then you're gonna wanna select A for add. You're adding a new discount or if you're editing it put e or if you're deleting it put d so if you have a lot of products then you will want to do it via this or if not that many products just type in your SKU right here boom i want to do percentage off it's best practice to do like 20 to 40 percent off and then you want to put a minimum price because these can be stacked on top of coupons and other discounts. So put a minimum price in there. Let's do two products examples here. They're both going to be the same. Yes, we're going to add. Okay, click validate products. Okay. Ready to submit. Starts on Black Friday, ends 11.59 p.m. Black Cyber Monday, rather. Submit discounts. Okay. There you go. It says success. Your discounts have been scheduled. The status should say scheduled. And if you want to edit, you can click edit right there. And that's pretty much it. Okay, a little bonus, something you can also do and look at is deals for the holidays. So go to advertising, deals, and then create new deal. And here it's gonna suggest uh, products that are eligible to run a deal, okay? Um, there's different types of deals. There's seven day deals and there's lightning deals. Lightning deals are one day, seven day deals are seven days. So um, looks like these products are eligible to have a December 6th deal right here. So um, this is something to test out as an all marketing, something to test out and see how it does with different products or a seven day deal. There are different windows, um, Christmas week and, um, before Christmas week in December. Um, <clears throat> sometimes the deal fee, um, during December can be more typically the fee is $150. A seven day de deal can be a bigger, uh, Amazon fee. But uh, if you don't know about those, that's just a quick, um, okay. So yeah, here's how you select the, uh, the single day deals. It gives you these windows and then it will run, um, at some time during the window. It looks like the deal fee is, is the same right now, 150 bucks. So this is something to look at, to test out if you're basically trying to drive as many sales as possible during Q4. All right, make sure to check out my blog to learn more, and to, uh, including five um, tips that you should be doing leading up to holiday season, including the uh, FBA, FBA, uh, FBA, FBA method, how to rot, not run out of stock. Let me know if you have any questions.